Hey guys, welcome to Hegan Iruthil and welcome to the global uh, close battle test tier list that we have here. And kudos to Discord uh, C86. Um, he is kind enough to make this tier list. This is actually only applicable to the first, um, what they call this, first uh, close beta. The second uh, close beta, which will be happening tomorrow, December 1, is going to have nine new characters for the game. So definitely our, our, our tier list will be expanding. And for those who are joining tomorrow, I'm just going to get you through to uh, more or less the ones that you must be investing time on especially if you want to go far um these are your tier zeros the ones that you must have um the ones that i used during during the first cbt was Glid, uh, gildan and sirslet definite sirslet is a nice dps to have um i wasn't able to level up Eluia because i had search lit and we had limited time definitely for the for this cbt if if i will be joining tomorrow then i'll try out Eluia as well but search lit and Eluia, you can't you know you can't go far from the both of them both of them have each of their you know their um strengths and as you can see here for search lit she has high crit and must for any team but also if you bring Eluia in massive burst damage the best dps for a single target so it really depends on who you're gonna bring for dps i think that is your best you know best uh bets for tier zero cloar i was able to use cloar as well but not that much although he she is easy to get uh gildan best tank um, hands down for the game. I suggest you guys also level her up. Screamer, also not. I, I haven't, you know, tried her out in the previous CVT. But these are the ones that you should have definitely. Let's go to somewhere between your tier zero and tier one. You have tier zero point five. Siamcom. Um, again, I wasn't able to use her as well. Fene as well. But Fene is going to be. A Pyro Ranger, small AoE, but high DPS plus AoE buff. Okay. For Siakam, it's a summon plus AoE plus stun effect. So to, in, in whichever case do you, you know want to play the game, here are all your DPS. Actually, there are a lot of DPS um, choices here from tier 0 to tier 0 0.5. Once you go down to tier 1, you have decent heroes that can be used what i I've, I've used here is uh i've used nuno for a time and also roko uh i used nuno actually during the long run she's not she's for me personally she is actually better than roko for me personally that's my personal choice but both of them nuno and roko can be a good healer when you need one also, I wasn't able to build Euphoria because I have uh, Gildan already, but she is a good tank as well. I also used Queen and Isa. Queen is an assassin with AoE damage, Sinister Eye, and Flexible Range. Uh, for me, I like how she was played. And Isa, you're also another DPS. She is a Frozen Tomb and good for controlling actually controlling enemies uh controlling the board and controlling pace so that is your tier one for tier two these are worth mentioning it really depends on if you're gonna be using them so mireya for dps ume for, as a tank celia as a healer and asa as a healer okay so there are other tips here in this jpeg by the way, this JPEG, I'm going to be putting a link in the description of this video so that you can reference this just in case you want to build your team tomorrow around this tier list. But definitely, please consider other characters coming in because we will have nine new characters um, added from CBT1 over to CBT2. So again, guys, um, a shout out to C86 for providing this tier list um and also guys if you have 
any comments please put them down in the comment section i will see you guys in the uh, cbt tomorrow so thank you very much stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here